In algebraic topology, the Betti numbers are used to distinguish topological spaces based on the connectivity of n-dimensional simplicial complexes. For the most reasonable finite-dimensional spaces, the sequence of Betti numbers is zero from some points onward, and they are all finite. The nth Betti number represents the rank of the nth homology group, denoted Hn which tells us the maximum amount of cuts that must be made before separating a surface into two pieces or zero cycles, one cycles, etc. These numbers are used today in fields such as simplicial homology, computer science, digital images, etc. The term, Betty numbers, was coined by Henri Poincaré after Enrico Betty. Definitions Informally, the KTH Betty number refers to the number of k-dimensional holes on a topological surface. The first few Betty numbers have the following definitions for zero-dimensional, one-dimensional, and two-dimensional simplicial complexes. B0 is the number of connected components. B1 is the number of one-dimensional or circular holes. B2 is the number of two-dimensional voids or cavities. Closely related to the Betti numbers of a topological surface is the Poincaré polynomial of that surface. The Poincaré polynomial of a surface is defined to be the generating function of its Betti numbers. For example, the Betti numbers of the torus are 1, 2, and 1, thus its Poincaré polynomial is the same definition applies to any topological space which has a finitely generated homology. The two-dimensional Betty numbers are easier to understand because we see the world in 0, 1, 2, and 3 dimensions. However, the following Betty numbers are higher dimensional than apparent physical space. For a non-negative integer k, the kth Betty number bk of the space x is defined as the rank of the abelian group hk, the kth homology group of x. The kth homology group is the other boundary maps of the simplicial complex and the rank of hk is the kth Betty number. Equivalently, one can define it as the vector space dimension of hk since the homology group in this case is a vector space over q. The universal coefficient theorem, in a very simple torsion-free case, shows that these definitions are the same. More generally, given the field f, one can define bk, the kth Betty number with coefficients in f, as the vector space dimension of hk. Given a topological space which has finitely generated homology, the Poincaré polynomial of is defined as the generating function of its Betty numbers, viz. the polynomial where the coefficient of is. Example 1. Betty numbers of a simplicial complex K. Let us go through a simple example of how to compute the Betty numbers for a simplicial complex. Here we have a simplicial complex with zero simplices. A, B, C, and D, one simplices, E, F, G, H and I, and the only two simplexes J, which is the shaded region in the figure. It is clear that there is one connected component in this figure, one hole, which is the unshaded region and no, voids, or, cavities. This means that the rank of is 1, the rank of is 1 and the rank of is 0. The Betty number sequence for this figure is 1, 1, 0, 0. The Poincaré polynomial is example 2. The first Betty number in graph theory. In topological graph theory the first Betty number of a graph G with n vertices. M edges and K connected components equals this may be proved straightforwardly by mathematical induction on the number of edges. A new edge either increments the number of one cycles or decrements the number of connected components. The first Betty number is also called the cyclomatic number, a term introduced by Gustav Kirchhoff before Betty's paper. See cyclomatic complexity for an application to software engineering. The 0th Betty number of a graph is simply the number of connected components K. Properties The Betty numbers BK do not take into account any torsion in the homology groups, but they are very useful basic topological invariants. In the most intuitive terms, they allow one to count the number of holes of different dimensions. 
For a finite CW complex K we have where denotes Euler characteristic of K in any field F. For any two spaces X and Y we have where Px denotes the Poincaré polynomial of X, i.e., the generating function of the Betty numbers of X. See Kuhnert theorem. If X is n-dimensional manifold, there are a symmetry interchange in K in n minus K for any K. Under conditions, see Poincaré duality. The dependence on the field F is only through its characteristic. If the homology groups are torsion-free, the Betty numbers are independent of F. The connection of P torsion and the Betty number for characteristic P, for P a prime number, is given in detail by the universal coefficient theorem. Examples The Betty number sequence for a circle is 1, 1, 0, 0, 0. The Poincaré polynomial is the Betty number sequence for a 3 torus is 1, 3, 3, 1, 0, 0, 0. The Poincaré polynomial is similarly, for an n torus, the Poincaré polynomial is, so the Betty numbers are the binomial coefficients. It is possible for spaces that are infinite dimensional in an essential way to have an infinite sequence of non-zero Betty numbers. An example is the infinite dimensional complex projective space, with sequence 1, 0, 1, 0, 1, that is periodic, with period length 2. In this case the Poincaré function is not a polynomial, but rather an infinite series, which being a geometric series can be expressed as the rational function more generally, any sequence that is periodic can be expressed as a sum of geometric series. Generalizing the above, and the universal coefficient theorem of homology theory, there is an alternate reading, namely that the Betty numbers give the dimensions of spaces of harmonic forms. This requires also the use of some of the results of Hodge theory, about the Hodge Laplacian. In this setting, Moore's theory gives a set of inequalities for alternating sums of Betty numbers in terms of a corresponding alternating sum of the number of critical points of a Morse function of a given index. Witten gave an explanation of these inequalities by using the Morse function to modify the exterior derivative in the Dura HAM complex.